One of the things that we really have to think about is where we put our treatments. You know, we got about a million and a half acres here on the Plumas. We're tying in with partners to help us uh, quite a bit. Uh, but we really have to target these areas where we have lots of values at risk. We have uh, homes around this lake. Uh, like we said, it's a water source, uh, lots of recreation value. So we kind of have to stack up, uh, you know, these values at risk and really think about, yeah, where we're going to go and what we're going to protect because uh, we can't protect it all. There's tremendous value in holding on to these pieces because it's uh, very expensive to start from ground zero. When we have to start at ground zero, you know, and you have your nuked out forest and there's going to be a lot of emphasis on uh, reforestation, you know, it's so much cheaper to take care of what you got. So I think that all that we can do is do the best job we can with the time we've got, you know, fix as much as we can, at least prep it so that when it does burn, it's going to burn uh, at lower severity. And we have some of those values still in place, some of those forests still in place, some of those recreational opportunities still in place, uh, some of those seed sources still in place. That's really uh, valuable. So I don't know what the future holds, but I think we just got to do the best job we can right now.